Hi, I'm Rich with Inside HPC. We're here at ISC 2019 in Frankfurt, and today I'm here with Bill Wagner from Bright Computing and Carlo Larise from NVIDIA. Bill, let's start with you. I understand that you guys are working together on something pretty interesting. Can you tell me more? Yeah, absolutely. So we're uh, pretty excited about something we've been working on with NVIDIA. Um, you know, the DGX server has been in market now for three years, and we've been watching our customers get more and more excited about the potential of using it to uh, advance their data science initiatives. And uh, that excitement is translated into them wanting to, for example, add DGX servers to an existing HPC cluster, uh, and in some cases build entire clusters of DGXs. And uh, so that's exactly what we've been working on, effectively making it easier for them to do that. So we're announcing the uh, availability of Bright Cluster Manager for DGX, which means that all of the capabilities that Bright Cluster Manager has for building and automating and monitoring clusters is now fully available for the DGX. Well, Carlo, from your perspective at NVIDIA, why is this an important thing for you guys to be doing? Yeah, sure. Um, it's quite interesting. We see some, uh, some very interesting trends. Ever since uh, 2012, with the um, introduction of AlexNet, we see that the uh, compute usage is growing exponentially. So it's, uh, it's even so that um, we see the doubling time of the compute needs is now down to three and a half months. So it's really amazing what's happening there, especially if you consider that uh, Moore's Law is slowing down. And uh, it's there where we play with DGX, so in this space to meet those uh, requirements for modern types of AI. And DGX, uh, as, as, uh, as we have seen, that's our um, purpose-built supercomputer for our AI. And we do actually two things there. So uh, one, we have an optimized uh, hardware environment. And the second part, that we also created optimized software layer that can uh, um, uh, um, utilize at a maximum that, that platform uh, which is there. Now, on one side we're making this appliance, but then we also see now that the other trend is that customers are doing AI at scale. So it's time to step up as well. So the new thing that we're doing right now is we're creating those reference architectures, which we call DGX Pods. And the DGX Pod is an initiative that we started uh, with our industry partners. We make uh, blueprints of, uh, of, of racks with multiple DGXs in there. And then we also looked at the, at the right configuration of storage, of networking, so that our users have uh, maximum performance, high reliability, the whole thing is supported. But even more important, you can scale from one rack and then throughout the data center. Now, and once you do that, we come to the next challenge, which is, of course, how do you deploy that in a smart way? How do you manage that? How do you monitor it? So that's where Bright comes into the picture. I'm really happy that Bright is now also offering support for DGX. Well, Bill, back to you. What does this mean for Bright and NVIDIA customers from your perspective? Sure. So it means, it means a few things. Uh, first and foremost, faster time to value for if you're building a DJX cluster or want to add them, that's the first thing because Bright automates the process of, of building the cluster from bare metal, sets up networking, user directory, security, uh, pre-test the hardware to make sure everything's working properly before we start deploying workloads, so that's the first thing. Second is it reduces the uh, administrative burden uh, on the administrator because Bright uh, automatically monitors and keeps things up to date across the entire cluster, provides detailed monitoring of what's happening with the NVIDIA GPUs. Uh, third is it makes the uh, the cluster incredibly flexible because with Bright you can mix and match a combination of, of lots of different types of hardware from different vendors and different platforms um, and run different types of workloads simultaneously on the cluster. You can combine HPC workloads with machine learning workloads, containerized workloads, non-containerized workloads all running on the same thing. If I may, if I may add something there, I think Bright and DGX are a really great uh, combination because um, uh, by combining the two solutions, you kind of can bring DGX as a service into an organization, or maybe better said, AI as a service uh, to the uh, to the internal teams, whether they are developers or researchers. So we'll take care in our combination of the AI infrastructure, how to deploy, how to manage it, and then uh, the researchers, developers can focus on, uh, on on their challenge at hand. And and by working together, we can really push the boundaries of, of modern AI. Well, great, because it is all about the science, so thanks for sharing this about this collaboration. A lot of excitement here at the booth, and uh, have a great show. Great. Thanks, Rich. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.